Hi, my beautiful Geminis. This is going to be your reading for the March 13th until the 19th. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter. So for March, we'll be doing a giveaway. And for this giveaway, the winner will get to choose any tarot or oracle deck of their choice. The winner of this giveaway, um, I mean, sorry, to enter this giveaway, you can either subscribe to my channel or if you've already subscribed <clears throat> in the description box below, you'll see, <clears throat> sorry, you'll see a link to my Instagram so you can follow me there. And if you want to do both, then that'll give you two um, entries in the giveaway. I've also opened up my services. So in the description box below, you'll see my services for questions and readings. So if you're interested, um, I'm now open for that. Okay, so let's get in. Oh, what is the mutual energy? So mutual energy is children. Your love life is being affected by children. So I don't necessarily think that all of you guys have children, but I do see that, um, you know, some of you guys may be in a relationship where right now you guys are in, you guys are fighting a little bit and you may be acting a little bit childish. Both of you guys may be seeing the other one as a little bit childish right now. Or the mutual energy is that you guys are both thinking about children and having children with each other. But I do see that, you know, on your side, we have attraction. You attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully, and your partner has engagement. Your love life is ascending to a higher level of commitment. So definitely, you guys could be thinking about having children with each other. Um, I do see that, you know, you're very attracted to this person, and you, um, like, it's not just, like, you're attracted to them physically, but I do see that you're attracted to them in more ways than just physical. It's like, this person is kind of everything. If you were to create a perfect person, this would be, that would be the person. It's like you're just pulled, you feel pulled towards this person. And I feel like your partner feels very similar because with engagement, it's like whatever situation you're currently in, they want to extend themselves towards you to offer an, um, a higher level of commitment. Whether that be, you know, you guys have been dating and they want to get engaged or you guys are engaged and they want to, you know, get married soon. Or you're just dating and they want to be you know, in a relationship with you. Some of you, they might want to move in with you. But I do see that this person really loves spending time with you and they want to be around you more. So I feel like, you know, you guys have been balancing a lot of things within your life since still trying to make time for each other. And it's time that, you know, like they really want to spend more time with you. I feel like they feel like you have a lot of obligations. You may have children and that may be, you know, the majority of your time is spent, you know, taking care of your children, but this person wants to spend a lot more time towards you. So I definitely see that they could be thinking about wanting to move in with you in order to get more of, you know, your time and maybe to help out with everything that you're, everything that um, you're going through and dealing with right now. Okay, so... I feel like, you know, your person is going to, you know, they've been really thinking and, you know, stuck about whether to, you know, how to tell you what they want to tell you, whether this is about committing or moving in or whatever, you know, whatever it is that they want to tell you, they've been really stuck on how to tell you it. But I feel like they're going to be, you know, they're going to get clarity on exactly how they want to tell you it, how they want to do this, how they want to show you. And they're going to be very straightforward uh, with you about, you know, how they're truly feeling and where they want things to go with you. They're going to be expressing their love towards you in a very pure and genuine way. This person has a lot of feelings for you and a lot of, like, they're very attracted to you and they have a lot of emotions for you that you don't really necessarily, like, I don't think that they, you may know, but I don't think that they feel like you know as much as you know, I feel like they think that there's more that they can, that can be said and they're really just going to be expressing their feelings towards you. You know, this person sees you as your, their light. They see you as the person that brings up the childish side in them. And, you know, you bring out their inner child. They see you as somebody that they definitely, I do see for some of you, this is somebody that wants to have children with you. Um, some of you could be dealing with the Leo. Some of you could be dealing with the Libra.
Yeah, your person may have felt like, you know, you're just too busy doing other things and they feel a little bit left out in the cold by you. They feel like, you know, like you're, you're going through other things or maybe you're just kind of off in your own head, you know, thinking about a lot of things and they feel like maybe, you know, when they talk to you, you're not really listening. So this is why they want to, you know, maybe offer you a romantic day or just really express their feelings towards you so that you know where they stand. They feel like they've tried before, but you didn't really hear them. Or maybe you didn't really believe them. I'm not sure. Maybe this is somebody new and you think it's too soon for them to be feeling this way about you. This could definitely be somebody that is younger than you. Maybe somebody you didn't take seriously because you know they're younger than you and you think that they have a, like a little bit more growing up to do. But I feel like this person is definitely in the energy of really like they really want to hold on to you. I feel like this person does stalk you and they 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 don't mean to do it to like check up on you it's more of like a protective way it's more of like they just want to make sure that everything's okay make sure that you know you're theirs and maybe you're not really with them yet so they're just really checking in to make sure that you know you're not talking to other people or whatever you know but I do think that you know a lot of the spying has to do with another reason as to why they want to um, pour their heart out to you and really tell you how they feel um, about you you know you're I feel like this person has you know had a little bit of a hard like t hard times before and they're coming out of that and part of the reason is because of you like you are a really healthy you're really healthy to them they you make them feel healthy you make them feel strong you make them feel light and they love that they just want to take a leap of faith with you and just start something new with you this could definitely be a new person for some of you definitely somebody that is younger but they want to move forward with you. They want to, yeah, they want to plan something with you. They see a long-term commitment with you. They see future with you. They see you as somebody that they want to be in a long-term partnership with. And they see you as not just, you know, someone to date, but somebody that they can build something with. Somebody that would be like a partner and not just, you know, a girlfriend or a wife or whatever. Like they see everything with you and they want to express that to you so that you know that they're, you know, where they're coming from, where, where they see this going. And they're really nervous, hoping that you feel the same way about them. Yeah, they see you as an empress. They see you as, a, like, the light of their life. You could be dealing with the Taurus and Aquarius or um, Taurus, Aquarius, Libra. And then I also have another Libra and uh, Leo here. But, yeah, they just see you as somebody that is so bright, somebody that is so vibrant, and somebody that is just so beautiful. And you attract a lot of attention, and that worries them. That makes them, you know, check up on you and just look to make sure that, you know, people aren't flirting with you, people aren't messaging you. They feel like, you know, if they don't make a move soon, you're going to be gone because they just see you as somebody that is absolutely stunning and beautiful and somebody that, you know, when they think of you, they think, who wouldn't want her? I feel like this person worries uh, when you're alone about, like, you know, other people coming to get, other people getting you, maybe somebody older getting you, or just somebody who, I feel like they feel like you're higher than them. They feel like you're above them. And I don't, like, I feel like, you know, either you or them, somebody in the past wasn't really expressing their feelings as much. But there was a lot of emotions there, but they just, you know, yeah, this is, you could be married to this person. Some of you could be married to this person and you guys have been in a patch where, may, you know, maybe you had children and now you guys just haven't really had that lovey-dovey time where you can just express your emotions and just really be with each other and, you know, go on dates and stuff like that. And they want to bring you back to that moment. You know, some of you, they may be wanting to do a vow renewal with you, but I do see that you guys have a lot of emotions for each other. You just haven't expressed them yet. But this week, you guys are definitely going to be expressing those emotions towards each other. I do see that you guys are going to be going on a date. Having a date night. Yeah, so they're definitely going to be... This could be somebody younger than you, for those of you that feel for some of you that are single. Um, some of you could be married to somebody that is younger than you, but they definitely want to, you know, I do see a lot of cards regarding children. So somebody could definitely be wanting to take things to the next level and have children. Maybe it's time for you guys to settle down and have children. But I also see that, you know, 
they're going to be expressing themselves to you in a way that they haven't before, a way to make it crystal clear that you are the one for them, that you are their soulmate. This person is really in love with you and they're so like they're so attracted to you. They admire everything about you, like from the way that you dress to the way that your heart is, the way that you talk, your voice, like everything about you is just absolutely perfect to this person. It's like you are perfectly carved out for them. And that's how they feel about you. And they want to really express that this week. So that is what I have for you guys. I hope you guys resonate with this video. And if you did and you want a reading or a question, my email or sorry, my um, information and services are all in the link below. And I hope you guys have a wonderful week. Bye.